Now that's what I call Metroidvania. So you want to make a top-tier Metroidvania. Blah, blah, blah. It's clear. Then strap in. It's time for a crash course. Let's start with a stellar setting, like a vampire's castle. Oh, how about an abandoned moon base? Actually, maybe not this time. A mysterious island. Oh yeah, a tropical crucible of crossroads, pitfalls, and puzzles. Toss in a few nasty hazards, a roster of man-eating mobs, now we're cooking. And don't even get me started on those hidden treasures. Next up, the heroes of the tale. Secret agents, each with their own personal brand of bad guy bashing. What do we have here? Magnetic arm, a grapple hook, and you can switch between heroes in a flash. Perfect for reaching new places. Now let's add some firepower because, well, I mean, you gotta. That's right, keep going. Oh, I've gotta try that one. Upgrades and customizables, they're essential. Players are gonna do things their way, so make sure you give them the tools and modules to blast in style. We're definitely not saving the best for last, the villain, Insidious Dr. Creed, and the legion of baddies at his command. A giant mecha? Check. A radioactive monstrosity? Double check. Now you see why we need the firepower. <laughs> there you have it. All the ingredients for a top tier Metroidvania. As you can see, we actually made the dang thing. This is our newest game, Blast Brigade. We'll see you on the island, Agent. We're done? Whew, I almost blabbed the secret ingredient. The key feature for the perfect Metroidvania, which we devs know is really 